out of milking your animal. We have built a machine integrating parts from both China and Italy to bring you the highest quality machine at an affordable price. When your new dairy made milking machine arrives, you simply take it out of the box, plug it in and you're ready to milk. To see how it works, here's a quick demonstration. Step 1. For best results you should feed your cow some grain during the milking process. This will not only keep her distracted, but also grain feeding increases milk production. Step 2. Wash the udder to make sure the teats are clean and free from dirt. Step 3. Turn the machine on and cut off the hoses to build up pressure in the bucket. It is most important to make sure that air can't escape through the hoses or pressure will not build up. Step 4. Watch the pressure gauge. When it reaches 0.04, you are ready to go. Step 5. For first time users, this step takes some getting used to, so please pay attention. Move down beside the cow and, one at a time, put the cups on the teats, starting from back right, front right, then back left and front left, as shown. Make sure you do this as quickly and as smoothly as possible, or you will lose pressure and the cups will not stay on the cow. Try to guide the cups with your hand rather than trying to look under the cow. This technique is faster and more efficient. Step 6. When the milk stops flowing into the bucket, it's time to remove the cups. To do this, fold the milk hose, cutting off the suction to the cow's udder. Then pull the cups off and hang them on the hook. Step 7. Turn the machine off and remove the lid from the bucket. And there you have it. Nice fresh milk. Alright, it's time for cleaning. This is relatively quick and easy. Fill a bucket with water and add some cleaning solution. Then, turn the machine on and drop the cups in the bucket.
When the bucket is empty, discard the water and start again with fresh clean water. You do not want any residual chemical in the system for the next day's milking. When finished, hang the cups on the hook and turn the machine off. It is also a good idea to wipe out the bucket and the lid. You can leave your machine to air dry, ready for the next time you want to use it. Thank you for taking the time to watch our instructional video. We hope you now have a better understanding of how our machine works. Goodbye for now and happy milking.